Dear Anna, Dance has always been an important part of my life. I don't know where I'd be without it. It was so important to me that I thought that I was willing to do whatever it took to look like what I conceived as that perfect dancer. But I never thought I'd take it this far. And I certainly never thought that you would come into the picture. It made me feel like I was in control because I was the one that chose to do this to myself. But I was wrong. You were in control. You made me think that if I didn't do things your way, then I'd never get my body the way I wanted it to be. I didn't mean for all this to happen. All I wanted was a change. I wanted to stop hating myself when I looked in the mirror. You know, I never really understood why I felt that way. Why I felt that intense need to look like the other girls. It all makes sense now though. Everything that I saw wrong with myself was because you made me think that way. I tried doing this the healthy way, but you picked up on my insecurities. You found me when I was at my weakest point and you made me your next target. Of course, at the time, I thought I was okay. I thought that what I was doing to myself was normal and that it wouldn't hurt me. I was wrong. When you first came into my life, I thought you would give me everything that I wanted. But all you did was take. You took my joy, my health. Eventually, you started to take my love for dance. It was at that point I realized what I was doing to myself. Surprisingly, dance is the one thing that helped me through all this. Everything you put me through. All the things I did to myself. Yet at the same time, it was dance that pushed me over the edge. The pressure I was put under to be thin it wasn't bad at first, at least until you turned up. And then that pressure became almost unbearable. It made me think that we were on the same side, that we were a team, that we were one person, that what I did, you did. I felt, you felt, but I was wrong. I'm a person, you're just a disorder. You're not my friend, you're the very thing that made me hate myself so much. Once I realized this, everything became clear to me. It was like a fog was lifted. I needed to stop romanticizing the very thing that made me want to wither away. I needed help. Dear Anorexia, it's been months since you left and I'm glad you're gone. I'm finally free and I never want to deal with you again. Anorexia, your curtain has closed and you will not be getting an encore.